Hey, hey, my peeps, it is the Goose Man coming at you with the exciting conclusion of Brussels victory uh, mission in 1945. <clears throat> I'm getting a, what is it, second wave coming at me and uh, kind of overwhelming me, but I'm still hopeful that I'll be able to pull this one off. So, let's take a look at what, what I'm facing. Nothing really around here, so I need to shift uh, everything while not leaving this completely open. Uh, over here to beat back this. Um, well, I know I have a force down here that is going to be pushing through. Um, <clears throat> but I don't think we'll... Basically, I just want to stop them from uh, being able to rush up here. I don't think they'll have enough time. My biggest worry is, of course, the force coming at me hardcore here. I I don't have really anything to stop. I don't have enough to stop it at the present. <clears throat> so I'm going to need to swing what I have here over here. Swing this uh, kind of over here, basically this one. <clears throat> and beat these guys back as best as possible. I'm gonna check the air. I don't think I have they have much in air. One, two. This bomber. Okay. So let's take that out first. I have 100%. I have three units I have left to deploy. So if worse comes to worse, I will just deploy more around here to prevent them from taking it over. So. Let's take our fighters and take them down. This bad boy. Oh, I can't reach. Well, let's try taking some damage off this one. Shred. Shred. No. Shred. Ah. <clears throat> the reason why I chose not to go do this one because I think I can be hit with what I have here. This is making them vulnerable. <clears throat> yep. Yep. <clears throat> and now I'm going to back them up. After I hit them, of course. Because they will come rushing, I feel, over here. And will allow me to get another ambush. <clears throat> Ooh, a lot to worry about. This is... Yeah. Just not going to get it over there in time. I was awarded a plus one spotting on this one. Which sounds not good. But um, is actually pretty good. Because... Um, in On Guderian you want to have vision on your units. Crap. <laughs>
Yeah. Let's keep it like that. Hold here. Yeah. I'll just hold. This will get a chance to play over here. You, you can't go here. Yeah. I'll just buy ammo. Oh my goodness, I'm out of ammo. The reason why I'm doing that is because this will free up. Yeah. <clears throat> Need to place something here, like by another elephant. This is going to swing around and attack this, which is not good, but. Oh, wait. Actually. Oops. Consideration, or most of you. <clears throat> yeah, I think I'll probably just buy another elephant to go right there. You are backing up to make sure no sneaky peek comes over here. Yeah, sorry, I'm jumping all over the place. So excited because this is almost over. So happy that they didn't destroy Joseph Priller. That was super close. And my tiger survived. That was amazing. There you go. He gone. He is going over. Yeah. I, I want him like not even close to anything. Oh, it's so hard to know where they're gonna come from. So this, I think, is a safe spot. Very unlikely that somebody's gonna pop in right there. <clears throat> this, however, is going back here. Goodbye at replacements, but what's the point? Because I'm going to destroy this right here. And this. <clears throat> so if anything comes out of here, I still got these backed up, and this is going to stay right there. There, 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 stay. Let's have some fun. Okay, let's go ahead and buy that elephant. These are nice stop gaps. The jagged tiger is, is 
Sí. <risa> Yep. All right, let's see what they do. Keep your fingers crossed. This is their second to last turn. <clears throat> it's okay. <clears throat> I'm just not going to have enough time. Okay, my last turn, and I have to prevent them from taking over anything. Yeah, of course I can't hit anything with this. You are not a nice person. Come on. Yep. Yep. to take these out. Hmm. Let me think about this one because these guys, there's nothing coming across here. Yeah. Nothing seems to be coming here. I won't have enough time to go here. You're just gonna remain out of sight, out of mind. Out of sight, out of mind. Bomb. Gone. It's just a cleanup crew. Yeah, of course. Hmm. <clears throat> yeah.
That Churchill has actually done very well. There it is. You take this guy out. Where should she go? Right here. Just ammo. Zip. And. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> Just zip it tight. Okay, I think this is going to end our turn successfully. 100% soft cap. Let's see what they do. I'll take it. Decisive victory. Oh, how sweet that is. I'm definitely taking a look at this battlefield. I'm seeing what else they had. They might have had a third wave, but it didn't materialize because I am playing on Guderian that does have some advantages on defensive scenarios especially. All right, let's look at the battlefield. I'm going to need to save at this point too so I can start it correctly. <clears throat> these were all open jeez so they had nothing left I could have taken it all and I probably would have gotten some captured equipment for doing that but I didn't know kept all this they didn't have anything I mean they had this obviously holy crap this was called Brussels I wonder why I didn't have to take over Brussels. Holy crap. <clears throat> oh, this was starting to move. This was just starting to move. This was the third wave. Yeah. Because these would all be entrenched if they weren't moving. You see that? Yeah, this, some of these were entrenched because that's where they're staying. This was just about to come. That would have been, and so were these. <clears throat> so that could have been potentially, had this gone five more rounds, we would have um, needed to switch our initiative, or to switch it over to this side. But I wonder what I would have garnered had I taken over Brussels or I know there's got to be captured equipment. It's just this battlefield reeks of captured equipment. But we'll never know that. Let's go on to the briefing. Oh, oh yeah, no, let's first take a, explain my strategy. I concentrated way too much force over here. I was thinking that there was going to be an attack wave over here, which never occurred. I needed to 
concentrate more on this side of the map. And once I destroyed the, if I would have had the, the crux here, I could have gone here and taken this over. <clears throat> and then of course, I would have seen what was around Brussels and pooped my pants. But um, then there's this area that gets attacked right away, or I don't think right away, but soon after the initial turns with the remnants of whatever forces are there that were easily, more easily destroyed. So, yeah, fun battle. Pleased with the outcome. Let's see the briefing. I see you have put our new wonder weapons to spectacular use. The Americans are finally showing signs of material exhaustion and their trapped and starving forces are surrendering, surrendering by the thousands. This shocking victory has paralyzed the American and British war efforts, but victory on the Western Front does us no good if the Soviets conquer Germany from the East. We must defend Berlin before we can truly capitalize on, our, on your victories here. Let's see my little snippet of movie. Kein verliebter Mund, wenn sich die späten Nebel drehen, werd ich bei der Laterne stehen, wie einst Lili Mali, wie einst Lili Mali. Comment, please subscribe, and as always, stay Lutheran, my friend.